What's up, friends? Today, I am reacting to Ren Sick Boy. You got a great response last time from the reaction that I did. A lot of suggestions. I've got quite a bit more on my list. So, we'll take them one video at a time. So, here we go. <laughs> seeing me looking at your file here it seems there's a very apparent interplay with your emotional state and your physical body have you ever heard of the trauma response i don't think so basically our bodies can get stuck in a negative feedback loop our subconscious can repeat patterns from the past which can have a pretty drastic downstream effect on our biology essentially your mind is making Looking for that fix boy, anabolic steroids, them so post a boy, pass out, white noise, quick fix, snake oil. I'm about to break boy. Oh, what a shame, he's in pain. Have another go. Take another pill. Here, take a couple more. Let's see how you're doing in another week or so. You'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show. Derealization, medical patient, losing patience with the process, walking hand in hand with Satan, complications with the medication, inflammation, dehydration, inhalation, aggravation, building up a toleration. Drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown. I've been feeling like I'm drowning with my feet upon the ground. I've been screaming, I've been shouting, but I never make a sound. I've been looking for a way out, but I always seem to drown. Is this all making sense, Ren? Um, yeah, I think so. Good. What I propose we do is we try to pinpoint the exact experiences from the past that are keeping you stuck. What can you tell me about your childhood? Uh, I can't really think. It's okay if nothing comes up right away. What I'd like you to do is take some deep breaths with me. In and out. In and out. Good. Now tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I feel like it's not me. It's the world that's sick. We're given everything we need and we commoditize it. We consume, we destroy like we're parasitic. Science tells us that it's suicide and still we come in. I'm not sick. We are sick. We are standing on a cliff in the name of progress. We jump off the precipice. I'm not sick. I'm the virus. You're the virus, hypocrite. How can you sit there with a smile on and tell me that I'm sick? Sick boy, sick boy, looking for a fix boy. Push it down in public, quick pose for the pick boy. Record label me. Things that come on the fire, your gift boy. Why are you so upset? Don't you wanna be a rich boy? Fuck no, industry is cutthroat. I've been doing bits by myself, swimming backstroke, walking on a tightrope, rapping with a slit throat. The way that we persist is like the ending of a bad joke. As the people evolve, we're complacent to assailants and we do what we're told. Counterintelligence is sight to behold. Rape the earth of all resources and we bleed it for gold. And we bleed it for wealth, we bleed it for fame. But when you bleed it, can you tell me what the fuck? Oh shit, it's almost over. Somebody's gonna bitch. You just sat there the whole time. So uh, I'll say it for 12 more seconds and then I'll say what I think. I'm not bleeding myself. I'm bleeding my brain. While I'm bleeding, I'm the reason. Because I'm doing the same. All right, so honestly, I didn't like this one as much as I did the first one, but I still enjoyed this one. I just said I didn't like it as much. I didn't say I didn't like it. I have to clarify that because somebody go, oh my God. He didn't say what I thought. That pharmaceutical cure for everything. We got a pill to cure what ails you. It's not curing you. I'm not saying medication never helps, but sometimes people in his condition, I mean, they they got mine pretty quick. Didn't help me, just let me go. But he knew something was wrong from what I understand, from what people are saying. And no one believed him or he couldn't get the help that he needed. Now, then he finally got the help. That has to be just horrible. On top of dealing with that, trying to make it in the business without selling out, doing your thing your way. I'm really looking forward to seeing the next or hearing the next ones that are on the list. There's several. I'm really liking this guy because he's different. It's, it's not so much political. It's definitely shining light on mental illness, something that's very near and dear to me. So... While I didn't like it as much, I still enjoyed it. I mean, hell, I didn't even stop it at any point. He didn't really give me a stopping point, but I didn't really stop it like I'm supposed to. 
Like I said, I'm sure somebody will bitch about it, but it is what it is. So, we'll just hang on. There's more to come. So, you know I like it. There'll be another one next week. So, thanks for hanging out. <laughs> Check out my one that I did last time. It's right here. And give it a thumbs up if you would. Y'all be safe. I'll see you next time. Peace.